In this tutorial, I'll show how to model this lens using Blender. First, add a subdivision surface modifier to the cube and set the levels to 3. Next, add a cast modifier and increase the factor to 1. This will turn your cube into a perfect sphere. After that, apply both modifiers. Now switch to the front view and delete the bottom half of the vertices. Select all vertices and scale them along the z-axis to 0. In Object Mode, right-click and set the geometry to Origin. Go into Edit Mode, select the Outer Edge Loop and scale it out slightly like this. Select the Middle Vertex, turn on Proportional Editing and choose the Inverse Square option. From the front view, move that vertex along the Z-axis like this. Next, select the Outer Edge Loop again and extrude like this. Then press F to fill the bottom with a face. Switch to Edge Selection and select these three edge loops. Press Ctrl B to bevel them with three segments, like this. Now add another subdivision surface modifier with two levels. Right-click and Shade Smooth Object. Then switch to Rendered View. In Render Properties, choose Cycles and set the device to GPU Compute. Lower the max samples for a faster preview. Now go to Material Properties, Create a new material and choose Glass BSDF. Set the roughness to 0.02. In World Properties, change the color to Environment Texture and load an HDRI for realistic lighting. If you want to hide the HDRI background, go to Render Properties, expand the Film section and check Transparent. Finally, turn on Denoise for a clean, smooth render. Now our lens is ready. If you enjoyed this video, give a like and subscribe. So see you next video. Thank you.